What's up? It's another Tuesday. Y'all know what time it is. It's time for Tuesday Thought. I hope everybody had a great weekend. So it's only five words for me to say. Let's get this work in. Let's go. What's up? Y'all know what it is. So I ain't going to tell you what's because you already know. I ain't going to be for you long. I'm going to say this and I'm going to When I was younger, it's a statement I hear all the time. Sticks and stones may break my bones, but words will never hurt me. As I experience life, I come to realize that that statement is a complete lie. Uh, let me tell you what I mean. Um, to me, verbal abuse is worse than physical abuse. Now, I'm not saying that neither should. I'm not, I'm not saying I'm not saying neither is right, but I'm saying to me, I think verbal is worse than physical. Let me tell you what I mean. Let's say if somebody take a stick or a stone, and they hit you in the leg hard enough. You break your leg. Eventually, you're going to heal and you're going to recover from that. But if somebody verbally tells that you're no good, you're never going to do nothing in this life and just give you all these bad stuff, feed it into your mind, sometimes it takes a longer time to recover from that. That's if that person actually recovered from that. Some of that stuff goes to people to the grave. It never leaves them. And in certain situations, it takes years off their life. So, let me give you an example. Let's say I have a dollar. Let's say you have $5,000. In what situation does my $1 trump show $5,000? It doesn't. But sometimes, I think when people get verbally abused, it, that $1, that one negative thing will trump the 5,000 and something else. So what I mean by that is like, I could have, a person can have one negative thought, but it trumps all the other good stuff they did in their life. It just, it just live rent free in someone's head. It's a statement that, um, I saw on social media. Taste your words before you spit it out. Simple as that. And I think that and the Bible even said the tongue is like a two-edged sword. So that's pretty dangerous. So that's why I think verbal, to me, verbal is worse than physical. So if that's the case, then that statement, sticks and stones may break my bones, but words will never hurt me. It's a complete lie because words um, cut sharper than any stick or stone that's ever created. I hope this makes some sense to somebody. I guess I'll talk to y'all later. Peace.